My name is Stephanie Hank, and um, I was part of the team that did the illustrations for the day when God made church. We were really inspired by um, Alexandra Ball as a children's illustrator, and she does um, really beautiful, whimsical stories for children, while at the same time kind of dealing with some pretty big truths or subjects. So we were kind of inspired by her color palette and her lightness. And then, of course, Tom Moore. Um, you may know him from Secret of Kells and The Song of the Sea. That was basically our inspiration behind the feel and the look and the process for this book as well, because it combines graphics and also hand drawing, hand painting, watercolors. In terms of process, like I said, we had lots of people involved. Um, I started with uh, storyboarding, just like really small thumbnails, breaking up the story in a way that makes sense and flows. You know, we sort of started fleshing out the drawings and the characters. Um, we had one person that did like lots of watercolor backgrounds, and that one was for this one. Um, this is talking about when Jesus died and remembering Peter reminding us that soon there was joy and laughter. So it's that transition period when Peter talks to the disciples about um, the resurrection of Christ. So we did a combination of sketches and drawings and watercolors. We tried to use a lot of like Christian symbolism, um, which was really fun because there's so many symbols like hidden in the background or in the patterns. Um, we also wanted that to be present in uh, this book. Overall, the color palette really reflected um, the Holy Spirit and hopefully will help kids grasp something that's really big and really hard to understand, um, but really exciting. Um, it gets their imagination and their brains kind of going.